A high-ranking official with the Guam Fire Department in the spotlight after he allegedly attacked his boss. The incident unfolding inside Fire Chief Joey St. Nicholas's office at the Haganya headquarters Thursday. The target of the alleged attack? The chief himself. We heard that there was an incident here involving you and it was one of your assistant fire chiefs I hear. Um, that person was arrested. Is he, that person on the job? Uh, well, let me just say this, Nick. Um, I will acknowledge that an incident did occur um, and it's been immediately uh, taken to our Office of Staff Inspector under investigation. Uh, anything beyond that, I will provide no comments at this time to protect the integrity of the investigation. Of course. Can you say if that uh, fire, if that personnel, though, is on the on duty still or has been placed on leave? I'll just I'll just stay, uh, say uh, no comment. The fire chief declined to release any details into what sparked the incident. KUAM confirms it was reported to Guam Police. Battalion Chief Thomas Tatautau, who is listed on the GFD website as the assistant fire chief and fire marshal, now finds himself in hot water. Sources say following the incident, Tatautau went to the Tumon Police Precinct to report that Chief St. Nicholas allegedly assaulted him. Similarly, officers at Central Precinct Command in Sinahanya got a complaint from the chief that Tatautau allegedly assaulted him. A witness also allegedly told police Tatautau was the aggressor. Police noting at the time St. Nicholas had visible injuries. That's when Tatautau was arrested on suspicion of assault and official misconduct. He was booked and released from custody. KUAM reached out to Tatautau for comment. Meantime, it's unclear if Tatautau will be placed on leave as the fire department investigation gets underway.